Yo, what up, what up? It's your boy C's from the CaesarLife.com, and I'm not even gonna hold you guys. I know what day it is. I know what day today is. It's the Super Bowl. So I just wanted to give a quick little video of my pregame predictions. All right. Now, preface. Okay, I am from Brooklyn. All right, Brooklyn, New York, and I will forever ever ever be a Giants fan all right so the New York football Giants is my number one team and they're like end all be all for your boy I happen to live in New England so therefore I am surrounded by Patriots fans so um, I'm totally like I'm not biased at all with this pick I'm just based on what I've seen so far this year. Um, I am just going, I'm not even going to hold you. I'm going to go with the New England Patriots to win the Super Bowl and deliver yet another championship here. Now, I ain't a hater. You know, I definitely give Tom Brady his due. You know, he is the GOAT. As hard as it is to say, you know, this guy has, you know, you know, I can't like I'm not even going front. It is tough for a Giants fan to live in New England, especially when the bum ass Jets can't pull it together and even compete for the NFC East. Like, come on, dog. Like, literally, like, get your shit together, Jets. You it's literally your fault that the New England Patriots are in this position year in every single year. Anyways, I digress. My end score is going to be 28 to 24 New England Patriots. I think um, Gronk Edelman is going to be yet another like torch barrier for the New England Patriots. And I'm going to have to witness yet another parade here. Oh, man, like it's going to be it's going to be a tough game to watch, you know, because I have no horses in this race, period. Let me just say that. I have no horses in this race because Giants aren't in it. And I'm just going to be watching it as an observer, you know. And I know this is a very tough time for the NFL and our racial divide in this country, you know, with the protests and everything. So I'm not even going to touch on that subject. I'm just giving you my insights and from where I'm sitting, you know, especially in a town where it's like readily known that we are living in a racist state. But, you know, I'm not going to get into that. You know, it's like basically how you look at things. If you look at it that way, then, of course, your feelings are going to match me. I just keep my vision on my goal and I strive to reach it. You know, that is my single priority. So I have no intentions of going deep into this unless it's asked upon me. Okay. Anyways, um, yeah, so I'm going to be at the crib. I got, we went to Costco yesterday, got some pizza, got some wings, and got some baked mac and cheese. So your boy inviting anybody to come through and come eat it and watch it. But you know, in New England Patriots fans, Patrick, you know, <laughs> He's scared, so he's going to watch it alone, you know, under his sheets because whenever Tom Brady is playing, it's like he doesn't want to be disturbed unless they win. <laughs> so as, you know, Jets fans as well. But, you know, us Giants fans, yo, we ride whatever. There is going to be a time when we're back on top and um, it's going to be sooner than expected. So just look out next year. Anyways, that's just my take. Let me know. If you watch this video, let me know who you guys got. Put it in the description below. Own your pick and um, we'll have a discussion post game. All right. Anyways, thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe. Holla. Peace.